The goal of this tutorial is to demonstrate how to refine your ISIS desktop search results. When searching for relevant documents, it can be helpful to drill down into different information containers. ISIS Desktop's multiple refinement options make it simple to narrow in on the results you are looking for. First, we will select an index to query and perform a keyword search on the information we are interested in. Our initial result list contains 310 hits and 57 documents. ISIS has already categorized these documents during the indexing process. By default, ISIS will use the path of the document automatically, but you can also use a metadata field. If we expand the categories tree, we can see the result list broken down into categories. This index has been categorized on a metadata field value from each document. This index uses the employee field. By selecting one of the categories, we can narrow the search results to not only the keyword we originally searched for, but also the employee name we are interested in. You can also revert back to showing the original document list by selecting All Items. ISIS also detects entities within documents while creating an index. These entities are grouped as people, organizations, emails, locations, and websites. ISIS uses a predefined lexicon to detect entities while indexing, but you can also supplement the lexicon with your own rules. If we expand the organization's entities, we can see a list of the organizations that ISIS has identified in the current result list. Clicking on one of those entities selects the documents in the current result list that also contain this entity. For datasets that contain metadata, ISIS will also provide metadata refinements. In the current result list, we can see that ISIS has grouped the documents using the metadata fields from the email header information to, folder, from, and employee. Expanding the metadata group will show the values for the metadata field. Clicking on a value will add it to the query and retarget our search. If you have any questions or comments regarding this tutorial, please contact ISIS support at helpdesk at isis-search.com.